is going on with the Jacksons? And yes, we are talking about Michael Jackson's family. We haven't heard any drama from this family in a while, so get ready for this episode of Famous News. I am your host, Stephanie Truco, and make sure to give us a follow wherever you're watching. Latoya Jackson, Michael Jackson's sister, is in the tabloids this week. Latoya's ex, Jeffrey Phillips, is looking to take her mother, Katherine Jackson, to court. So Latoya's ex, Jeffrey Phillips, wants to take Michael Jackson's mother into court over long-standing claims that he allegedly stole $1 million worth of memorabilia from the family. According to the Radar Online, Phillips has requested that a judge stops all future hearings until he has officially deposed of the 92-year-old and have her sit in for the deposition to find out why she's under the impression that he had stolen personal belongings from the Jacksons. Given that Latoya and Philip were together for a while, the Michael Jackson estate has also accused Phillips of stealing and wearing the late Michael Jackson's pajamas that he wore on his deathbed, while also allegedly getting away with Michael Jackson's mobile devices, clothes, home videos, and pills. What? And this is all, of course, without the family's consent, allegedly. Phillips said that he has visited the King of Pop's home with Latoya shortly after the singer has been rushed to the hospital June 25th of 2009. And if we remember correctly, that is also the same day that he was later on pronounced dead. So even with the heart-wrenching news of Michael Jackson's passing, people seem to really believe that he did in fact steal a lot of things from the Jackson family. And if he did, that's kind of messed up. Respect the dead, respectfully, especially if it's Michael Jackson. The estate continued by claiming that Phillips tried to make money from the stolen items, such as 109 CDs and DVDs. And a lot of them were autographed. And I think we both know how much money that is worth. In his argument, however, Phillips contends that this was Catherine's idea, Michael Jackson's mother. He said that she initially told him to take the items from her son's home since some of Michael Jackson's belongings would have gotten cleared out if no one came to claim them. So I guess we'll just have to wait and see. What do you guys think about this story? Would you actually buy one of Michael Jackson's autographed CDs? I know I would. Let us know in the comments down below and we'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.